So, I've not uploaded a video in a while. Um, I was halfway through uploading a video, but um, like things happened. So, I couldn't. Um, I'll tell you the story. So, basically, um, two weeks ago now, uh, should be a chair. Two weeks ago now, I had a real bad like kitchen fire, like house fire, and it was like really scary. It was just horrendous. Um, the cooker decided that it wanted to blow up, and so it did. Um, and in result of that, my walls you can see are like totally like bare and. Yeah, um, we're just in the middle of, you know, just stripping everywhere. We've got, yesterday we finally got our new kitchen fitted fully. Um, they finished it yesterday. Um, and then, um, yeah, we still need a new cooker. And, well, we need to get some new, like, appliances and things um our cooker we haven't got a cooker we don't have home insurance or anything either uh so <laughs> we are screwed um but yeah we've got a new kitchen finally i've got some new kitchen units um i don't know if you can see actually the ceiling see it's black um which is like was there i just saw this orange glow and then um i was like shit there's a fire so I had to phone up um the fire brigades they come out um i was really obviously distressed and it was just a very scary time for me um i knew that me and my husband were safe so that was fine um Although he did, um, his asthma did get affected by it um, because of the smoke. Uh, it was just really bad, so, like the living room, it's just like, it's not black, 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 if you know what I mean. It's just like, it's you can tell that there's been a fire in the house somewhere. And the living room, it's got like black walls, like patches and stuff. Um, but my husband, I was on the phone to the fire brigade and I was like, don't go in there, there's a fire. Cut the front door open. And then um, he decided to come in to see what was going on. And he got his phone torch because he was going to switch off the electrics. Um, but he couldn't reach it. And then he started coughing and he had to come out. And then the fire brigade, um, the fire engines, they turned up. And then, um, yeah, they put the fire out. It was the cooker, obviously. Um, they put the big fans all the way through to blow the air and whatnot. And then I realised my cat, Sooty, because obviously amongst it all, I forgot. I feel I like I felt terrible. I knew nothing bad was gonna happen to him because he was in the bedroom. Um and he generally doesn't like people, so I know that he he would stay there, especially with all the noises. And then um they said that they're gonna have a look what's his name and I said Sooty. So very apt, <laughs> you know, if I'm a walking pro, shine sooty. Um, but yeah, so he was underneath the bed because um, I was worried when they said that I couldn't find him to begin with because uh, all the windows were open. And I was like, oh shit, a cat's missing. And then I was like, no, he normally hides where the bed is. 
Um, it's got like a little cornery bit around by the wall. I don't know if I'm explaining that well. But yeah, he normally hides there and he was there. Um, and then my mum and dad come. I had like three panic attacks because it was just so scary. And I was coughing. It was just horrendous. I lost my cooker. I lost a lot of my kitchen stuff. Um, but luckily we were alive and stuff. Um, and yeah, we were lucky because where the flames were, our gas boiler is like next to it. Um, so that could have easily have been hit, but it wasn't, so lucky. And then two days after, we had to take our cat to the vet um, because he was sneezing and stuff and we thought it was been damaged by the smoke um, but it was fine it just turned out to be like allergies and then last night well yesterday my nan had a stroke so everything literally does happen in threes and yeah <laughs> I want 2016 to be over already I can't I can't deal with this anymore I'm close to cracking I just I can't <laughs> Hmm. But yeah, decorator's coming in next Friday, so yeah, that's literally it. Um, thank you for watching, and so it's not a great video, happy one, but yeah, <laughs> I'm close to exploding. But yeah, um, yeah, I shall hopefully upload that video soon. Uh, I'd shut it down, obviously, to the electrics and whatnot, but yeah. I'll upload soon. Thank you for watching. Um, yeah, humidity is not my friend. <laughs> but yeah, so please like and subscribe. And always, always keep an eye on the cooker. And make sure you've always got a fire alarm fitted. Uh, and then it works. Okay, stay safe. And see you soon. Bye.